What is up guys, it's X-Rays and welcome to your daily dose of Battlefield 4. Now, in today's video we're going to be discussing the Battlefield 4 experience from what I have learned playing on the PS4. Uh, there have been some issues, some updates that have come out uh, because of some of the, I guess some of the little glitches and bugs and issues that were plaguing Battlefield. Uh, quite a bit of people were upset uh, with some of the products and you know even DLC is being delayed for the PS4 in order for EA to be able to kind of you know fix these issues and address them uh, and make just overall make Battlefield a much more enjoyable and fun game to play. So for those of you that were wondering what exactly some of these issues were there was just like you know some glitches in the game that were happening you know a lot of people were upset because Battlefield is a game that's supposed to be you know not perfect because no game is ever going to be perfect but it's supposed to be one of those top tier games that just shows example and it does just the way it looks the way it plays just the fact that it's a tactical game it's a fun game to play uh but it had a lot of issues uh, especially when it launched it had a lot of issues that were getting patched and it's still getting patched with some issues that you know linger here and there uh but overall the experience i've had on ps4 has been amazing I i'm actually enjoying playing Battlefield, I uh, wasn't able to play Battlefield for a while because even though I had it on PS4, I wasn't able to record, uh, so I just kind of had, you know, random sessions of playing, and the difference between Xbox 360 to PS4, and, you know, once I get this for Xbox One, I'm planning on getting it for Xbox One since I have more friends on Xbox than I do on PS4, uh, just, it's weird, I don't know why, I guess a lot of people have more Xbox One than PS4, and it's just weird, but it's just the way it is. So I've kind of been dabbling with uh, playing Conquest because I, I have been able to, I've been kind of sticking with Domination, kind of sticking to playing, you know, close quartered maps and I haven't really noticed, uh, you know, how big these maps really do get. Uh, I was playing Conquest uh, when I was playing the demo and when I was playing uh, Battlefield 4 on my Xbox 360, but it's not the same experience. When you're playing on PS4, when you're playing on next gen or PC, you're able to play with a lot more people. So in this game I was actually playing, it was a total of 64 people playing at the same time, which is mind boggling, you know, from someone coming who uh, played, you know, Call of Duty or who played, you know, shooter games where, you know, even before there was, you know, online, it was just like co-op offline where it was just like four people battling out playing some GoldenEye or, you know, playing some, you know, 6v6, 9v9 was the most that, you know, we've played and a lot of people have already, you know, gotten used to playing with huge amounts of people, 32, 64, especially when they play on PC. But, you know, for the console player, for the person who's played on console, it's kind of been that first time ever that they've gotten this chance to play with, you know, a much bigger group of people and play on a such bigger scale of warfare. You know, just not, not just like small maps or maybe not big maps, but with not a lot of people that felt empty. But these maps are huge, just amazing. There's a lot of maps where I was playing Domination only on, on Battlefield, and I never really noticed just how big the maps were. I never noticed, uh, you know, parts that were connected to the Domination portion that I was playing in. And I'm just having a lot of fun playing Conquest. It's, it's insane how much fun you can have from, you know, getting inside vehicles, flying helicopters, taking out other, uh, you know, air support, taking out other enemies, you know, sniping from a distance. It's just so much fun, uh, you know, trying to balance playing, you know, objectively with also just, you know, kind of having fun exploring and you know, more than anything, just kind of having fun. Uh, so if you guys have not tried Battlefield 4 with 64 people on Conquest, you guys have to definitely try it out. It's just so much fun. It's crazy just how much fun you can have, even if you're playing just by yourself, like you just, you know, you're the first person, uh, first person out of the group of friends who's gotten a PS4 or an Xbox One and you're playing by yourself. It's still just a ton of fun to play. Uh, so if you guys have not already picked up Battlefield 4 or maybe you haven't played it on PS4 or on PC, definitely play it it's just a great experience it's a lot of fun the huge maps just the the environment people playing tactical not a lot of douchebags around it's a lot of fun it definitely is just exploring and having fun is just one of the greatest things ever especially when you have a group of people who actually know what they're doing and you're winning games pretty easily uh, but anyways guys i hope you guys enjoyed the video if you did remember to slap a like and a favorite uh it was kind of funny i was playing in this game and <laughs> it was kind of lagging i don't know i don't know if it was lagging or it was something but like i would be riding like this vehicle and it would just be like stuttering and just like suddenly having like forward shifts or anything uh but it, it, it was a lot of fun and especially right here i actually take down this helicopter 
Uh, it's, it's pretty pretty crazy. It blows up right in front of me. That was that was like the most fun I had ever. It's like blowing stuff up, getting crazy and maniac, and you know just going completely bonkers uh, while playing a game, which is something you can't really do in other first-person shooters. Uh, but anyways, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Remember to slap a like and a favorite if you guys have any kind of content you guys want to see Battlefield related in the future. Let me know. I'm gonna have a new weapon review and breakdown out later this week. Uh, so I'll see you guys next time. I'm X-rays. I'm out. Peace.